Uh, not everything about Miguel Cabrera has always enamored me. I, I, I say one thing, it supersedes everything else. He's probably uh, the greatest hitter I've ever seen. Certainly the greatest right-handed hitter I've ever seen. You know, in the time where I've been watching games, maybe Albert Pujols in his prime uh, would be like him, Barry Bonds from the left side, uh, perhaps. But I will say this about Miguel Cabrera. Uh, despite his defensive shortcomings, depart, despite his deportment off of the field, despite some of the myth about Miggy being Miggy when he smiles out there and sometimes he's not the most pleasant person, I respect what he said the other day about you know, playing hurt and the way it's perceived. I couldn't agree with him more about that. And I'm glad Ron Gardenhire backed him today on it because that is the reality of it. These guys go out and they play hurt. And when they play hurt and they don't play as well, it's like anything else. If you're not 100%, you're not going to be as good as you are. And they're playing at the highest level of the game. Uh, you're going to get some criticism. And often when I've tried to defend players who are playing hurt, I get pushed back from fans like, oh, they're lazy and these different things. And that is absolutely true what he said. And I also respect what he said about Robinson Cano. And when it comes down to medicines and what happens in Latin America, you know, uh, one of the things that bothers me about the testing, you know, through the major leagues and minor leagues, it seems like there's a high percentage of Latin American ball players that are busted for this. And sometimes I wonder if, one, they know the, you know, the rules, uh, you know, whether they have the agents who are giving them the information that they need. Certainly that wasn't the case with Cano, but doctors in other countries who may not be as uh, uh, skilled and as adroit as they are in this country. And I respect him for standing up for his ball players. I find the whole steroids thing, the PED thing, uh, to be a completely uh, uh, convoluted and confused issue. And Miguel Cabrera, above all that, he said what he thought. In the media, we often sit back and go, oh, nobody says anything to us. Oh, they give us, uh, you know, these cliched answers. Well, he said exactly what he thought. And it was good to get some perspective uh, from Miguel Cabrera I don't think he speaks frankly enough, and uh, I salute him. I'm glad he did.